I put Post Malone in WW2K24 Universe mode for one year just to see what would happen. Here we are once again in Universe mode, but this time we got the new Post Malone DLC, the new DLC pack just dropped at the time of this recording. So I said, let's put Post Malone on the SmackDown roster and let's see if my boy can become WWE Champion. First SmackDown... <laughs> He looks so out of place, bro. So we got AJ Styles versus Santos Escobar versus Post Malone in a triple threat match, bro. I mean, Post Malone, come on. Damn, I'm not, I can't say I'm surprised. They made my guy Post Malone a 69 overall for some reason. I mean, I say that and I know the reason, but still, he's not on backlash. Let's not even waste any time with that. We just got to see if my guy Post Malone, we're going to give him one full year. I mean, he's already another triple threat against Big E and Randy Orton. If he gets this dub, that's going to be pretty big. No, he lost again. I mean, I can't say I'm surprised. I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> I I would be surprised if he wins a single match. Another triple, bro. This dude's been put in every triple threat, and he's taking every pin. This time against Cody and AJ Styles. Is Cody still the champ? I just gotta check. Cody is still the champion. So if we win this match, we could be beating the WWE champion here. Oh, nope. Cody Rose wins. Post Malone with another triple threat loss. This man cannot catch a break as we move into Night of Champions. And of course, he's not in the pay per view, so we're moving on to next week. Post Malone is the first like celebrity dlc as he's main eventing against aj styles on smackdown he actually won post malone has officially been aj styles <laughs> what a sentence man but we got the first dub for post malone over here you know i think about it i should have put him in nxt he would have done numbers over there but oh well too late we're on the main roster he already beat aj styles he's already here he's done the bro this would get gets put in multi-man matches all the time cody rhodes wins come on bro buy all the multi-man matches give me some one-on-ones like that against the wwe champion cody rhodes and we lose of course but still i mean we're getting our reps in we're getting our reps in okay post malone is gonna win one championship He's gonna do it. He's gonna win the belt. He's gonna win the big one. He's another triple threat. This time against AJ Styles and Austin Theory. And he loses another triple threat. This this brother cannot catch a break. Another match against Cody Rhodes, the WWE Champion. And he wins! Post Malone beat the WWE Champion. What timeline are we in, fellas? Yeah, he's still the champ. This is, this is the best timeline. We might actually have a chance. What if we're like in the money in the bank ladder match, low key? Another match against Cody Rhodes for Post Malone. This time Cody Rhodes wins. As we're moving into money in the bank, maybe we're in the money in the bank ladder match i don't know okay we're definitely not in the, ma in the ladder match unfortunately yeah, yeah, that, yeah never mind that that's, that's it. it this time we got post malone against big e yo book post malone's getting booked every week he's a workhorse low key and he gets a win against big e and looks like he's finally in his first rivalry against big e Shout out to Big E, of course. Damn, this is like the first match or the first SmackDown he's actually booked in, but he might screw around in Big E's match. I'm just kind of curious. Post Malone took complete advantage of the no disqualifications of the match by entering the ring and attacking Big E. Despite a legal but honest action, Big E is likely to find an opportunity to get even for the attack. I still can't get over how out of place this man looks. <laughs> bro looks like an NBA 2K my player, bro. Post Malone already back at it, putting in another match against Big E. He loses this time, but hey, he's a workhorse, bro. Don't doubt post malone's work ethic this brother is already getting booked week after week after week and he's being the WWE champion in a singles match as he's going up against robert Roode for some reason he loses to robert Roode. probably biggie got in the middle of that but we're going over to SummerSlam and biggie versus post malone at SummerSlam. <laughs> what a match indy hartwell versus ronda rousey are main eventing so you already know this universe mode is cursed and he loses that's unfortunate you know i'm not even that pressed his, his overall is so low i feel like every win he gets is like a big deal bro is a 69 overall by the way nice but still i mean what what's the division looking like yep he is the <laughs> he's the number nine contender he's the lowest contender hey man you never you know, know okay? okay and the next week he's teaming with big e they just got off a rivalry now they're besties the power of positivity is is converting this man hey they actually won yo low-key new tag team in a rivalry match oh no it looks like they're still in a rivalry actually and they're teaming again against karrion cross and kit wilson that's a random team and this time they lose hold on let me check on the news real quick nothing there was nothing there never mind big e again this time against uncle howdy and ashante d adonis the most random Random team of all time we take another l biggie we need you to do some of the more heavy lifting here you're a higher overall man low key i might just switch him out of the wwe championship uh division and just put him on tag team division 
I mean, he is in the new day, but like, we're doing it for the greater good here, okay, guys? We're doing it for the greater good. I feel like this could be interesting. You know, we never usually go for the tag team championships, and I don't think he's gonna win the WWE title. He's just too low of an overall. So this seems to me like a perfect opportunity to make a dream team. <laughs> All right, the team is officially created Post Malone, Biggie, and now they're fighting again. And Post Malone gets a dub. They cannot make up their mind. Are they gonna fight or are they gonna like square up? This is this is the storyline here. Post Malone versus Biggie, the final match. Who will win, the power of positivity or the NBA 2K My Player? And the power of positivity has won. Biggie has taken the dub. We're just gonna sit here and pretend that now they're best friends because they were teaming so much. The power of positivity has converted this man into a baby face. And now that that storyline has concluded, we should go after the WWE Tag Team Championships, correct? No, we're just gonna keep fighting. The new team Sunflower Positivity is born. They were fighting week after week, but now they're brothers in arms. They do coexist. Why are y'all doing this now? Post Malone is teaming with Randy Orton as Big E teams with R-Truth. Y'all supposed to be a team. When we win, I mean, I'd much rather team up with Randy to be completely honest, he's a higher overall, so he can carry me. But I thought we were gonna be the sunflower positivity, man. Now we're doing it again, and we win again. Yo, Randy, Randy with the carry job right now. Bro, this, these dudes that cannot stop fighting. I've tried making them a team. I've tried, I've tried. I really did. I thought we could make something special of this, of this connection that Post Malone and Biggie had. I thought we had something special there, but I guess not. We lose, we lose against Biggie and our truth the power of positivity has won. So are we just gonna team with Randy now? Like, what's up? Now we're teaming with Jimmy Uso? What is going on? Ooh. Brother, we lose to Ashanti Adonis and Robert Roode. Robert Roode is a producer now. We're losing to producers. I was hoping we really could have a tag team championship run. Now we're going up against Luke Gallagher. Why? What is, you know what? Let's get the dub. Thank you. Thank you, Post Malone. Thank you. Big dubs. So is the team like cooked now or what? Like what's up? These brothers just cannot coexist. It just can't happen. I guess we're on the solo run. And I really wanted that team with Biggie to work out. I really did. I wanted to work out so bad. Now we can't even get booked. Where did it all go wrong, man? Now we're team with Jimmy so again well i guess we won all right cool or we're playing we're, we're one against luke gallows again yo luke gallows taking l's against post malone putting me over i appreciate you man are we gonna become a tag team with jimmy uso now like what's up we're teaming with jimmy uso against the good brothers over here that's fine let's get a dub though shall we there we go post malone jimmy uso taking the win in the rivalry match in the pay-per-view are are we gonna see post malone and jimmy uso team up now damn post malone been putting in work he's an 80 overall he went from a 60 to an 80 yo he is putting in the work we're gonna put him in a team with jimmy uso we're just gonna see how this goes i'm curious he's just getting new tag team partners every week yo we're teaming again you love to see it oh we lost against the street profits nah nah we can't lose against the street profits we gotta get championship shots we're going against them again rematch we lose again oof next week on smackdown we can't let this happen man we this is our opportunity to actually get some wins now we're going up against switch and ashanti diodonis or, or freaking pete dunn there we go we get a win that's what we like to see we get wins we need to build up to get a championship team tag Tag team championship shot. I can't speak English. Now we're going against the Creed brother. Brutus, why is he even here? Why is he on SmackDown? He should be on Raw, but whatever. I digress. We lose, but it's okay because we're so close to getting a good team tag team championship shot. Oh, they're tag team champions. Oh, and they retain. Oh, oh, oh. We're a rumble. We're a rumble. It's looking really good right now. Match against the Creed brothers. We win. Right now, we would be the tag team champions if that was a tag team championship match. We've made it to the Royal Rumble. We're already here. We're getting close to that one year mark, so we got to have something to show for it. Come on. As here we are, the Creed Brothers versus Post Malone and Jimmy Uso with Solo Sokoa backing us up. I don't know why they even put us on the right side. We're not the tag team champions, are we? Yeah, we're not. We're not the tag team champions. Anyways, it's time to watch this masterpiece of a match. It's gonna be the Creed Brothers versus Post Malone and Jimmy Uso for the WWE Tag Team Championships. Let's get this done. Here we go, Tag Team Championship match, bro. Post Malone, we're finally actually gonna be seeing him in action against the Creed Brothers. Oh no, oh no, okay. Creed Brothers are in the babyface corner, that don't mean shit. 
All right, we got Jimmy Uso on our corner and Solo Sikoa. Post Malone, an honorary Us, honorary Bloodline member. If only Tama Tonga and Tonga Loa were actually in the game, then we could get even more backup for Post Malone to win the Tag Team Championship. Jimmy going for the pin. Almost got a two count already, bro. Come on, <laughs> give me the title. We got like four months left in the sim. I gotta have something to show for it. All right, we, get, we need Jimmy to do like all the heavy lifting here. I mean, Post Malone has actually got him his reps in. He's actually a pretty decent overall. Now he's like an 80 when we last saw him. So, I mean, that's a big improvement from 69. Jimmy putting in work, actually. He's actually doing pretty good. Putting in the work. We love to see that. <laughs> Well, Jimmy just got busted open. It's okay. You gotta let him cook. Let him cook. Let him cook. Let him put in the work. Yes, I mean, honestly, he's kind of he's kind of getting beat up. He's kind of getting destroyed by the Creed brothers right now. Bro, Jimmy ain't doing anything. Oh my God, dude. Jimmy, fight back. Fight back. Fight back. Hit him with like one of your million super kicks. Oh, oh, oh. I, I guess he actually got the tag. Oh, oh. Oh, no. Uh oh oh my bro julius is putting in work we gotta fight back solo do something yes block him yes that's what we like to see oh my god it's immediately reversed bro come on post malone we need you to clutch up oh solo solo putting in the work he threw him how's he not disqualified there you go post there you go big knee okay he's fighting he's actually doing stuff what is this yo technical wrestler Technical wrestler Post Malone. Oh. Jimmy, why? I was doing a setup. Post Malone was going crazy, bro. That, that's crazy where Jimmy really screwed up our all our momentum. For real, for real. There you go. Fight back. What? Come on, ref. That can certainly not be legal. Bro, Julius is getting putting up numbers. He is destroying us. Like, really bad. Like, it's really bad. Oh, there you go, Post. There we go. Fighting back. As we like to see, we need to win those tag team championships. Yo, maybe double team? No? Just look at the, all right. Just, just getting some, some work on the arm. Okay. Fair enough. Okay. Going over. There you go. Spine buster from Post Malone. Going for the pin. A one. A two. No. Okay. What is he doing? What? What is he doing? He's just using ability? Oh. Oh, this is your chance. Bust him open. He's putting in work. He's going crazy. Oh, my God. Finish him. Do something. Oh, no. He reverses. No, no, no. We can't let this end. We can't let it end like this. It can't end like this. Reverse. No. Oh, my God. He almost landed on his head. Oh, he's going towards Jimmy. Oh, no. He's going. Solo. Solo's doing running the distraction. Yes. Keep. Go, 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 go. Take him out. There we go. Now we got to tag in Jimmy. Tag in Jimmy. Oh, no. Take care of him. Ah. Nice little slap. Going for the pin off a slap. I don't think that's going to work. It's probably going to give us a one count at most. Almost a two count. You know, a little better than what I was expecting, but we take it, I guess. Post putting in work. Really wants to work the arm for some reason. He really wants to work the arm for these people. He's going to tag in Jimmy. Jimmy is in. Jimmy is in. Time for Jimmy to put in work. What the hell was that? What the, What did he even do? No, it better not screw up our momentum because we really need this championship. We need to have something to show for. We need to have something, anything. Use a super kick, Jimmy. Do anything. There we go. It's going for the tie. It's going for Uso Splash. What the hell? Headbutt, bro. Bro thinks he's, he's Brian Danielson right now. What, what is Post doing? Going after Julius. Damn, he got clocked. Oh, no. No. What is this? He was distracted. That's not fair. That's not fair. He was distracted. You can't do that against the rapper. Okay, a nice little combo in the corner. Dang. What the, what the hell was that? Going for a pin. Okay, sure. One and two. Oh, not enough? Of course, I'm not really surprised. We gotta, we gotta hit him with like one of those cutter or powerbomb finishes you got. Oh, like this? Like this right here, powerbomb? Power bomb! Oh my god, a cutter! Never mind, he's going for the pin! That could be it. One, two, no, it's not enough. It's not enough. He needs like at least one or two more of those. It looks like he's tagging in Jimmy. Jimmy's coming in. Super kick! Another super kick! Going for the pin off the double super kick you can attempt. I can't speak. Julius does not care. One, two, three! The super kicks were enough! 
the super kicks were enough, and Jimmy and Post Malone are the new WWE Tag Team Champions. What a timeline we're in right now, man. What is going on? Let's go. <laughs> and just like that, we got Post Malone to be a WWE Champion, man. Why did I click on this match? And just like that, he's the WWE Champ. Now we just gotta defend those titles until the end of the year, and we're gonna be Gucci. Freaking Post Malone brung the titles over to the bloodline, and he immediately loses his first singles match after winning the title. This man, I'm satisfied. We got Post Malone to be a champ. Genuinely, I mean, he already winning against DLWO. We didn't cheat. We used in-game storylines to tra First, we wanted Big E, but then we got into a team with Jimmy for some reason, and we turned that into a team, and now we're tag team champs, and now we're main eventing every SmackDown. The rise of Post Malone is crazy, as we're in Elimination Chamber, and we're defending the tag team champions as Roman Reigns and Solo Sikoa in our corner. We can't lose against the LWO. Come on. Of course we're not gonna lose. We got Roman Reigns and Solo in our corner, bro. You think we're losing? Heading over to SmackDown. Down. This this tag team championship reign is gonna last forever. We win against Brutus in a 1v1 in a singles match. This man cannot be stopped. He's too powerful now. He's officially part of the bloodline. He can't lose. He just can't lose. All right, we're just we're gonna ignore that. Wow, we're defending the WWE Tag Team Championships against Montez Ford and Angel Dock and the Street Profits in a random SmackDown. We better not lose. We don't got we don't have blo you know the bloodline. We don't got Roman and Jimmy here, so and we still retain. That's two championship defenses under the belt already. Another singles match against Brutus. We lose. We're not we're not gonna we're, gonna, we're not gonna say that. The Go Home Show to SmackDown is here. Or I'm sorry, the Go Home Show. To SmackDown. The go home show to WrestleMania is here. And we're fighting Brutus again. And we lose again. We're gonna pretend that they're happy as we're gonna move over to WrestleMania, the final event of the year. And Nikki Cross is main eventing WrestleMania. Wow, what a timeline. Post Malone is the WWE Tag Team Champion. Nikki Cross is main eventing WrestleMania. Butterfly effect going crazy right now. And we're doing a rematch pretty much straight up against the Creed Brothers for the WWE Tag Team Championships at WrestleMania. Can we finish off strong? Can we finish off strong? Yes, we can, as Jimmy and Post Malone retain the WWE Tag Team Championships at WrestleMania against the Creed Brothers. We're just too, we're just unstoppable, man. We can't lose. We just can't lose. Post Malone's a WWE champ. It just can't get better than that. I guess we're going up against the Good Brothers next, and we're winning there. And then final SmackDown of the year. I mean, it's life is good, man. Life is good. 1v1 against freaking Ho Joaquin Joaquin, whatever, how you say his name. And we win and we beat him. I don't care how you supposed to say the name and that's gonna be it for today's video y'all we, we took post malone from being a 69 overall to being the number one ranked wrestler on smackdown yes really i'm not joking he's the wa tag team champion he joined the bloodline he got jimmy uso as his tag partner and he's still the champ regardless if you enjoyed the video make sure to hit that like button subscribe to the channel leave a comment down below and i'll see y'all in the next one peace